Hello, my name is Gabriel from Gabak Business. In this video, we're going to talk about audiobooks versus music or why I don't listen to any music. So you're going to see, uh, maybe if you're on, on business and you like to start, keep learning all the time and, and other things, that you will find out, like, like me, at least in my case, I'm going to tell you a little bit um, about me. So a few years ago, I said, okay, I need to learn more uh, and listen listening music it will not help me at all so it will not pay my bills basically so i quit uh, listening uh, music also I, I found out a lot of other good things about it so when i go you know to supermarket yeah you can listen music maybe when you go to church yeah you can listen music as well and you can sing maybe a little bit but in in the daily basics i don't listen music so and i don't do it because i see myself that i'm not using my time wisely so when i drive let's say if i have a trip and i have to jump in an airplane or maybe i have to drive to a customer or whatever is the reason so every time i sit on the car i put an audio a book an audio book in, in this case and i use all the time even when i go for vacation and other things I use my time ex exclusively for audiobooks and that way I can learn. So if you are driving maybe one hour, two hours or half an hour every day when you go to work or whatever, that is one thing that, that, you, that you can use because other, other, uh, otherwise you're going to be wasting your time because it's, let's say that you go to work a Monday to Friday and then you have maybe half an hour to go another half an hour to come back and then you have just one hour that you just wasted maybe listening to the radio or some music or anything like that that at the end of the day it will not help you to pay the the bill so that is is, is very important i mean if you want to get ahead you want to learn you you want to share the knowledge that you have with others so that is very important so that is uh, very basic at least uh, for me so in this case if you have knowledge but you don't have any action it's like you don't have any <laughs> knowledge so knowledge without action yeah, it, it means nothing so m many people say no knowledge is power yes knowledge is power when you, you when you take action no action is the same like like nothing so another, another thing that you're going to find about, I mean, I'm going to talk about addictions, mood, uh, relax, uh, relaxation, uh, people, re relationship types, um, all related to, to the music. So it, for instance, addictions, people, maybe you, maybe it's not your case, or maybe you know someone uh, like that, but you will see uh, those people who, uh, cannot live without music so they have to have something some some kind of stimulus all the time in order to to live because otherwise because they don't have any any uh, plans they don't have any goals anything like that so they they have to keep something in in their mind because their mind is empty and they have to keep some music all the time and the brain will get used to it to this kind of stimulus so if you don't have any stimulus or something like that you you think that something is like is lacking or something like that but that is not the the case is if you if you i mean if you see yourself or, or if you start doing what i'm saying you will see that after one week or two weeks you you don't you don't have any music or any, anything like that and you are not going to miss it and when you want to realize one month later you are free Otherwise, you're going, you, you need to something in order to be happy all the time and, and all the things. Mood. So that is very important. So people are moody. Maybe they need music in order to be happy or to have the energy or, or other things. That is why you will see in the workout videos and other things that electronic music all the time because people, they, they, they cannot focus or maybe they have something else in their mind or maybe they have nothing and, and that is very sad. So the, the thing is at, at least what I, I found out at least in, in myself is because I don't listen to any music or anything like that. So my emotions are more much stable. So that way, yeah, it's, it's, 
it's different <laughs> like it, it, everyone else because uh, I'm happy 99% of the time if, if I am not happy for something is uh, is very rarely but usually yeah, I'm happy 99% of the time all the time and I, I don't need something some stimulus in order to, to be happy or to have more energy or anything like that I just wake up I need to do something I if I write uh, down my, my goals so I, I know what I'm going to do the rest of the day and all those things that's it so uh, I don't need any anything else so this is like the uh, caffeine you know there are people who need to be drinking coffee all the time because otherwise they feel sleepy and all the things so that is another stimulus that you need to excite uh, your body in order to be productive and all the things so the less uh, things that uh, that you need the better so that way you're going to be more stable so and the other thing is uh relaxation so people are thinking well yes uh, maybe I, I i drink a few beers i don't drink either so and they say well i i need i drink some beers i, I listen some music and then maybe I, I smoke a cigar or something like that and then i feel relaxed why i mean i don't get it i mean if you have control of your body you don't need any of that for instance when i have to go to sleep and go I, and I sleep i don't need to listen music or something like that in order to cope with the stress or another thing so what I, I do is i control myself and i know how to do that so that way i don't have stress on my life and if i see that something is going out of wax or something like that and i'm start getting uh, some kind of stress because something is someone is pushing you or something like that you can say no yeah i'll do my best i'll try to do it as fast as fast as i can and uh, that's it because many people i mean if you don't know but uh, there, there are books that talks about that and there are a few authors that say the same thing M many times the deadlines are something that someone creates from nothing i mean and they say uh, okay now the, this day is going to be the deadline uh, maybe it's not <laughs> and nothing is going to happen if you go further maybe one or two days more or even a week more or sometimes the customer will say no you, you know what the, this day that we said no i have a surgery or i'm taking a vacation or something like that and you know not, nothing happened so another thing that you will see with the uh, with the people this is the next uh, subject a uh, people uh, relationships types so in this case you will see that people who listen uh, rock all the time uh, metal uh, and all of the or electronic music usually they take drugs uh, they when they dress weird you know all in black or they have you know those this special kind of dress um, or cloth at least for those uh, heavy metal people and they have their the hair is sticking up uh, and other things so when you have the other type of people you know those who like maybe Mozart or Beethoven or, or classic music you will see that those people usually they have they are in a higher position they they think different they are not uh, acting like crazy and all those things so yeah you may have a little of everything <laughs> in both sides but what I'm, I'm talking about is in general you are you're going to find out that these the people who likes music uh, is like high medium class or the higher class the upper class and you will see that is is better of course if you're on business you want people who have money and not people who are in drugs or maybe <laughs> they don't have enough money to uh, to live to the end of the of the month so another thing i'm going to tell you how i, li I listen to music i use my, my cell phone i use audible.com so they are not paying me anything but that is what i use is from amazon just in case if you don't know so you can buy the the books over there and what i do in order to listen at least one or i mean to listen six books a, a month or six books monthly i i listen them in 1.5x or 2x depending of the author um, and the quality 
of, of the audio and that way you can learn faster and you can reach more of course another thing that, that you will find uh, is over time if you are thinking well uh, 1x is fine if i want to listen maybe 1.25 or maybe 1.5 is too much what you can do is in the beginning you can start with 2x at least for five minutes and if you can listen for five minutes even if you don't understand everything that is okay but that that way you will train your your brain to assimilate the in the knowledge faster um that way you you will learn faster over time and after the five minutes like i mentioned before you can uh, go step down you can step down and you can listen it on 1.5x and the way you will say oh now i can understand much better and when you want to realize you're listening the the books uh, much faster so that is very good so in case if you don't know that maybe you have uh, read this uh, before but uh, usually the ceos or the directors of big companies they uh, there is a saying or or that is what i read that uh, they read at least six five or six books a, a monthly so that is great so i'm trying to achieve that every month and that is um, what i'm i'm doing and it works great you have maybe books that maybe they are like three hours long and because if you listen in let's say in 2x you will see that you will be listening or you will finish those books in half of the time so in one hour and a half you're done with the book there are another books that are most of them are like 12 hours maybe in a few days you can uh, finish them all as well all if if you, they are longer maybe like the bible in my case uh like 72 hours so yeah even uh, what I, i've been trying to do is in in a whole year listening the the bible in 1.5x uh, is is a good state still and uh, i can finish the whole bible old testament new testament in six months or less so that is that is great i mean it's a good achievement most people they don't even read the bible once once a year um and in addition to all my my books so that is uh, another thing that 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 they do so I, when i have to do something like it doesn't take you or the, it doesn't use a lot of brain power maybe you are building a computer or maybe you are vacuuming the house or doing something mundane that doesn't take a lot of uh, brain power or maybe you're organizing some cables or maybe uh, some things uh, something in, in your bedroom or something like that you, you can use your, your time to do that also sometimes if i have to cut the grass a, a little bit that um, and i use the tractor i use those ear protectors that comes with bluetooth and that way meanwhile you do something productive you are listening in, in audiobooks and that way you can do more of course with with every with all the time that that you have and when you are eating for instance i have done it um, before is i us usually i i listen some book or i watch maybe some youtube video about some class or something that i want to learn and then that, that way you use every minute of the of your time in something useful that will uh, give you some knowledge that you can use in any time because maybe even if you have information uh when you encounter some kind of uh, problem or something like that you will see oh yes i've read this i know how to solve it and then you solve it so that is knowledge in action so it depends on what you want to learn so that is is, is very is very good so if you're like me please leave me a comment in the section below i would like to find more people that, like me so what i i do is i find i have my own group where we meet every week and we discuss about different books and things that we we have learned also we do another activities uh, to learn uh, maybe a class about x and x thing maybe how to sell maybe or how to listen better to other people or, or whatever we, that we want to learn and that way uh, you you can prove yourself if you don't do that if you are thinking well maybe friday i'm going to use it for uh, playing poker or something like that that is a waste of time when you when you can do something productive for you and for others around you 
So I hope you have enjoyed this class. If you have any question or if, like, like I said before, if you're like me, please leave me a comment in the section below and see you next time. Bye.